Alright, so I already did my face, my art eyes, and prime my eyes, so I'm just gonna jump straight to the eyeshadow. I'm using Makeup Geek Peach Smoothie on my crease as usual. And just take a blending brush and blend it until you're happy. Now move on to Tea Face Chocolate Bar Palette. With the same blending brush, I'm using milk chocolate on my crease and take it a little bit further and just keep blending. And then I'm going to be using my makeup eyeshadow high tea. <laughs> yes, I dropped my eyeshadow. It didn't break fully, but it breaks a little and it hangs me. Anyway, I'm using that shadow with the same blending brush. I'm just, you put it, it um, bleh, bleh. I'm just put it on my outer V and blend it out. And now I'm using my MAC Extra Dimension shadow. Uh, I just got it recently. It, it's a simple color. I'm, I'm not sure if it's even in the market, but you no, know, maybe you can look it up on ebay anyway i'm just gonna pack it on on my lid just pack it on slowly gradually and kind of like slowly take it onto the crease make it a little bit smoky without using my blending brush but of course we have to go in with blending brush but like just if you pack it on slowly it will help creating that smoky effect it's better in my opinion and using the makeup wipe to clean up the excess, I'm just gonna move on to concealer. And as always, I'm gonna blend it out with my Real Technique sponge. And also, I want a little extra covered coverage, so I'm using Maybelline Fit Me concealer. Then I'm gonna set my under eye concealer with Macrolin setting powder. And a little bit more blending because it it is a smoky eye after all. Even though we want to keep a little less dramatic and more daytime wearable, a little dance party uh, as always. Um, now I'm gonna take my ColourPop Super Shack Shadow Cornelius uh, it's from the quad that Catherine Light did with ColourPop and I'm just gonna use a flat tip eyeshadow brush to put it on, the, on my lower lash line and now I'm going back to high T my makeup key shadow to just you know, smoke it out a little and now I'm gonna use Makeup Beach Shadow Shimmer Shimmer to do my highlights. And I'm gonna use a flat tip eyeshadow brush, a smaller one than the, than the one that I used, to put it on my inner corner. And I'm then gonna go ahead and finish my liner. And then I'm back with mascara. I'm using Kiss Me Vowing Up mascara, I think. Um, I just love this mascara. I always use it, always. And as you can see, it, it takes forever <laughs> to fucking curl my lash. Excuse my language. For some reason, it's just so much easier to curl my lashes with my bow hand. I have no idea why. Is it just me? Does anyone else have this kind of problem? Sure that this took forever. I swear to God that do my lashes is just the part that takes the longest in my makeup. And this is when a typical tragedy happens to any girls who do makeup. I got some mascara on my nose. You can't see it, but it was there. And then, 
both my, both lashes done. I used all three of those mascaras because I want my lashes to be longer, so I don't want to wear any falsies. But still, I want it to be beautiful and gorgeous. Um, I'm just wanting to show you what kind of song I was listening to. I love this song. I just love it so much. And today I'm using Kiko Ray and Touch highlighter. I'm just dabbing it on with my finger. As always, I use two highlighters. Today I'm gonna use um, Wired and Well Frederick Center Stage Collection Hollywood Bella Bird to highlight my cheekbones and taking a little bit of excess to highlight my forehead. And then my brow bone, of course, and Cupid's bow, and my nose. Of contouring, I'm gonna use Elf Contour Brush and the Elf Contour Palette. Use the darkest shade to contour my nose first. And now I'm just going to take a smaller angle brush to blend it out. Then I'm going to contour my cheekbone with Benefit Hula Bronzer. And here I just want to quickly show you the difference that I can make. Using my e.l.f. blush palette. Um, I will be using the brighter pink with a slight gold glitter and mix with the uh, orangey color. <laughs> lip combo I'm using today is Australia Bell Lip Matte Lip Cream in Miami and MAC Dazzlers Lip Gloss in the shade Eurobeat. Uh, but you can use any gloss that you like. Now you're done. I hope you like this look. I really like it and I've been so excited about it. Um, so I hope you like it and give me a thumbs up if you do.